Meyer, can I have a moment of your time today? Of course. Actually, could I have two minutes and 23 seconds? Yes, I can spare that. All right, how long have you worked at the Academy? I think this is my ninth year here. What class do you teach most often? Uh, U.S. History Modern. Where did you grow up? Cromwell, Connecticut. Do you have a favorite historical era or time period to teach? In the U.S., I think I am very interested uh, in teaching and uh, learning about the Vietnam War era. What's something you love about living in Providence? Uh, great restaurants everywhere, great art scene. There's always something to do. Uh, I love that my daughter is growing up there and getting to be exposed to a diverse group of people and a uh, beautiful city. Who's your favorite author? Probably Kurt Vonnegut Jr. if I'm going to go classic. What were you like in high school? Let's just say that when my students give me a hard time, I deserve that. Cats or dogs? Cats, but dogs are lovely too. Coffee or tea? Coffee in the morning, tea in the afternoon. Who's a fictional character you can relate to? Probably uh, Miss Frizzle. <laughs> Love that. If you could teach a subject other than social studies, what would it be? English, I think. What's your favorite movie of all time? Let's go Empire Strikes Back. Who or what makes you laugh? My daughter, she is four years old and everything she says is funny. And my wife as well. What's the best teaching advice you've ever received? You're here for the kids, remember that. Do you have a prized possession? A sign from the woods that I used to be a camp counselor at. It says outpost and for many years I was an outpost uh, camp counselor. And it was in my living room up on the wall. What's a travel destination on your bucket list? I think uh, Italy. And my timer is silent but I swear it's going on, so we will use sound effects to make that. <laughs> oh, that was the time.